Hello, Old School Gamer 1971 here. Greetings one and all, especially to you Millie and Lloyd. Today my third hour thoughts is on Rage Injustice. I've been playing this game for over three hours and this is what I think. Rage Injustice by Making Games Limited 2018. I was interested as soon as the trailer dropped. It was a side scrolling beat em up, a bit of nostalgia so to speak. I used to spend hours of money in arcades as I've discussed many times on the channel. So having played it for a while, it is a really good retro side scrolling beat em up. You have a choice of three characters. Rick is the hard hitting police officer if he is a little slow. Nikki on the other hand is not too slow but she's also not as fast as Ashley. Nikki is also a police officer. Ashley is somebody from the streets who is really quick but just doesn't hit that hard. And then it's off onto the streets. Before you start a level you're shown a screen with different bonuses you can achieve for combos, score, arrests etc. This adds to the gameplay and to achieve them all is a real task sometimes. It's a normal affair button wise and control wise, where it is different though is the visuals. The visuals are outstanding for a game of this ilk. The art style is most definitely arcade but it looks so very good. Having three people team up is also good and real fun. The story is generic, the mayor gets abducted, its combat is nothing new and I don't think it will win over any new fans but if you're after some side scrolling arcade fun, grab this some mates, some beers and let the good times roll. So that about wraps it up, I hope you all have a good day and this has been helpful in any way, like, subscribe and comment. Please let me know what you think, Old School Gamer signing off.